Hey everybody, how's it going? Today, it's time to review this Sony Ericsson K700i E3022. This phone already been past 18 years, and so without further ado, let's get started. This is Sony Ericsson K700i was released in 2004. This is how it looks like for the front side and at the back side. But there is no battery for this, that means I can access to the UI, really sorry for that. Without waste any time, let's straight away talk about the spec. It's a 1.78 inch with TFT display, 65K for the color display, 176p for the resolution. At the top, it has a Sony Ericsson logo, core receiver at the top with some chrome for the core receiver and as well as the for the side screen, silver color for the front part. And the below, it has a fully keypad button, also in silver color, Vodafone model. Let's move to the back side. At the top, it has a VGA rear camera with LED flash, chrome for the selfie, just like this. And this is antenna, it should have a cover but it's gone. Speaker at the top, a little bit grey for the circle. Center it has a Sony Ericsson logo, at the below it has a Sony Ericsson green and silver. At the right side it has a shutter camera button, black and silver. At the left side it has a volume up and down and photo and video mode. At the top it has a power off button and this hole I'm not sure for what. And last but not least at the below it has a rubber cover. You can open it like this. Old Sony charging port, including for the headphone connector, 93 of gram, fully plastic phone, 41 MB of storage. This phone is really nice, with very big size of side. I, I really like the design as well as the color. So. Sony Ericsson K700i And so before I end this video, you can give a feedback for my Sony Ericsson K700i review after 18 years in the comment below And so that's all for me, thank you very much and don't forget to subscribe to my channel See you on next video, goodbye and have a nice day